unscored interval IOA, um, inner observer agreement for those of you that haven't caught on yet. Um, so uh, in this case, we're going to look for agreements of non-occurrence, right? So non-occurrence of a particular behavior. In this particular interval, Bob did not pick his nose, okay? Um, if one person doesn't see it, then that's an interval that we're going to use to, to count, right? So we're going to count only the intervals that have non-occurrence, and then we're going to count the numbers of those intervals that, people, that, that the two observers agreed. So if both people didn't see Bob pick his nose during that interval, then great, there's an agreement. And then the next one, maybe one person didn't see him and the other person did, hey, there's a disagreement, right? So they disagree on whether it occurred or not, but it's gonna be one of the ones we count because somebody didn't see it, right? Um, so it grossly underestimates behavior. Uh, you take the total number of, the, the total number of intervals of non-occurrence, divide it by, or to take the total number of times when they agreed that the behavior did not occur, divide that by the total number of intervals that contained a non-occurrence from either one, um, you end up with a ratio, multiply that by 100, and you end up with the inner observer agreement.